What's going on YouTube? Skygrounds here. Got some fantastic news. But first, I must deal with pressing issues. Cynthia G. <laughs> oh, did you fuck up. I mean, I've seen some bonehead plays before, but Jesus Christ, girl, you took the fucking cake. Are you a girl or a guy? God, never been quite clear on that one. <coughs> I mean, honestly, there's some stupid shit to do, but what you did, you might as well have thrown a literal rock at people. You literally stomped on the black community and pissed on them, so one well, of your only real sources of support. But hey, you know, people like you, you flip-flop. Worse than a pancake at IHOP. So, I can always say that I stay consistent. I'm against stupidity. So I was against you from day one when this channel started. Now, on to the next piece of business because, frankly, that I'm not going to be doing any more videos on her. It's like beating a dead horse. I've made my points very clear. She is an idiot who doesn't understand simple concepts of reality. And her hardcore fans, neither do they. So we're going to move on to one Donald J. Trump. What are you doing? <clears throat> this is going to catch a lot of back flack, but, you know, I really don't care. Because, frankly, you are screwing up royally when it comes to dealing with your allies. <clears throat> Look, I get it. I'm not a big believer of the climate change, neither, but... There is a little evidence to support it. I mean, we could use a little more uh, environmentally friendly fuel sources. Gas is not a good one. Anybody can agree with that. So I think maybe you might want to revisit that. I'd like to see the electric car come. I would buy one. I think they would be fun. It's quiet. Very quiet. So I'm not a liberal, nor am I a conservative. I kind of don't really meet any criteria. I kind of sit right in the middle. That's where I like to be. I wouldn't say it's on the fence. I'm not a communist. I could never do that, nor am I a fascist. I just can't do the goose step. I do it. I can speak a bit of German, but could not do the goose step to save my ass. <laughs> so, everybody's worried about the big end. How the world's going to end. How it's going to all just... Bye-bye. I don't know why you're all worried about it. I'd be worrying about living. See, I'm... I got something to live for. I'm going to be a dad. Yep, there's going to be a wee little Gekrons running around. <laughs> In 12 weeks, I'm a papa. So this Father's Day held a little more special meaning to me this year. And I'm happy. Because it's going to be easy. He's healthy. Yeah. Healthy, healthy baby boy. So Gekrons is happy. I'm a happy, happy, happy man. Now, to all you religious guys and gals, knock the Bible talk off, because frankly, it's not helping. Frankly, if Jesus Christ and God were going to do anything, they'd have intervened long ago. So quite clearly, like the Quran, the Bible is BS. Religion in general is just BS. You can believe in a God. You don't need religion to do so. You don't need to be a Christian to believe in God. You don't need to be a Catholic to believe in God. Maybe you just have a spiritual connection. <clears throat> and also, I gotta ask, when the fuck did Jews become a race? I thought it was a religion. I mean, you can be from Jerusalem. You can be from Israel. You can be from Canada, America... You can be white, Arabic, black, and be Jew. I thought it was a religion. It's not a race. And Copper Cab going to you. 
I'll get back to the whole end times subject. Uh, gingers are not a race. It is a fucking hair color. Get over yourself. Take your special victim's point, shove them square up your ass. I haven't done a video in a couple of days, so I'm getting things out. Now back to the subject of the fourth. And that would be the end times. If the world is going to end, so be it. It's going to happen. One way or another, either tomorrow or a million years from now, it's going to happen. Goddamn cat fur everywhere. Vacuumed in there, shed like bastards in the summertime. If the world is going to end, does it really matter? Do you really want to know when it's going to end? Probably not. Unless you're going to prepare to try to survive. Praying is not surviving. Praying is kissing your ass goodbye, trying to suck up to whatever deity you can to, you can suck up to, and uh, hope that you can get in with them. Frankly, I think hell would be the better deal. I mean, how do we know God's the good one? Maybe Satan just had a bad hair day and God's got a great PR man. <clears throat> so, anywho. The whole end times. What a pile of BS. Do you really think fucking cloud formations is a good sign for end times? It's strange weather phenomenon have been happening for centuries millennia okay it happens okay that's why they're called phenomenons I mean Jesus Christ every fucking one of you is coming up with every friggin literal nugget of BS that you can pull out of your ass look what Steve McQ McQueen said before he died are you kidding me? Who cares? He's been dead for how long? Who gives a fuck? I mean, holy shit. You people are basing everything off of every fantasized fact you can pull out of your ass. I mean, holy fuck. Get your heads straight, for Christ's sake. I use that term as a term of what the fuck are you doing? Not because I'm religious. I mean, I may have spiritual belief, but I'm not a Christian. I'm not a Catholic. I'm not a Buddhist, Hindu, Muslim, or any of it. I think it's all crap. If there's any deity I believe in, which I do, it's Odin. I mean, that guy kicks ass. There's a god with some balls. I'll believe in that before I believe in Jehovah or Allah. Anywho, moving on. So I kind of want to go to Copper Cab. I've noticed that you've been actually keeping up with your word. Somewhat. And seeing you in the shower was disturbing. I almost threw up my breakfast. So I'm going to be covering that video. You guys have to see that shit. Look for that tomorrow. And now, the big news. The big unveiling for tomorrow. We have been painstakingly working on a website. And it's going to be fun. And we are also going to be setting up a, uh, <clears throat> a donation system that you can donate to any of the channels that is on that website, which there are three. There's mine, Gekron's. There's Zafro and Life on Earth. Three fantastic channels covering a wider range of topics. We do that. Gaming tutorials, game reviews, computer imaging, computer editing, all kinds of fun stuff. It, it, it's just phenomenal. Life on Earth is phenomenal with computer software. It's fucking ridiculous. And Zafro, hell of a good gamer. 
think you guys might want to check it out. Definitely get your uh, hands in that cookie jar. So I will be revealing where you can find it. Where you can go. Because if you do, I'm going to be a bit of a spoiler. Because I'm excited. You could have a one-on-one -on -one chat with me. This guy right here. Even you trolls can have a one-on-one -on -one chat with me. If you have the balls. <clears throat> or if you like my content, you can tell me to my face that, hey, I like your shit. It's alright. So. It's gonna be fun. I'm gonna try to do it once a week. For a couple hours. I'll bring one person in. We have a little bit of a uh, chat chat time. And we go from there. And we're going to go through the list. So if you send me a really fantastic, fucking awesome, and well intelligent com comment in any of my videos, and I notice it, I take note, I will send you an invite to the live stream. That is what I will do. That is how I will decide. So, like, subscribe, share, comment down below. Become part of the Gekron's army. And I'll see you guys in the next video tomorrow. Take care. I hope you had a wonderful Father's Day. Take care of yourselves. And MGTOWs. MRAs. I'll be looking for you boys firsthand. Because this is a place where you can chat. You will not get kicked. Chat to your heart's content. And if you're a feminist, you may not want to visit. Take care, guys. Bye.